I mean, you are currently married, correct? Yeah. Yeah. And she was, she's always been excessively supportive and, uh, very, very fortunate, very fortunate, uh, to, I, to not have been left alone through this process. I think that was probably a rumor out there that you were divorced. I could have swore at some point in time that I read that you got divorced or something. Um, I did not create that rumor, but it made it easier for me. I was like, see, I'm not that bad. I was divorced at least, but no, I was, I was never at any point in time. But, uh, Rip, do you think if you would have had cameras back in the day, you would have filmed any of this stuff that you did? My God, I'd have had a whole fucking phone <laughs> full of bitches. Talking about who, who was it? Go well, ahead. Sid Vicious or somebody came out and said, man, they're, they're not doing anything differently than we used to do all the goddamn time. The only difference is we didn't have phones. Right. <laughs> like, that was just thank you. Normal, I appreciate that. A normal day in the life of a wrestler. Yeah. And, I mean, Rip has told a million. That was just accepted the way it was. But my, my big thing was, okay, I'm eating right. I'm going to the gym. There wasn't no, I wouldn't be looking at porn or whatever. But that night when everything was done, when you had your workout complete, I'd be in the dressing room pumping up the whole time, doing push-ups, squats, lunges, whatever, until I perform. Then, then when I'm done, now it's time to enjoy yourself. And if I'd have had a phone for each one, I'd have the world's biggest, well, they call it putting it on a cloud or I'd have a, <laughs> the or whatever, cloud. What, whatever I'd had, I'd have <laughs> how many, however, many that that would be, I'd have everything categorized. <laughs> mocha, <laughs> light skin, mocha, <laughs> mixture of this. Everything that. ends in mocha. <laughs> yeah. Gotta, gotta have some, gotta have some mocha in there for me. Well, Rip, I, everything's on the cloud somewhere. So maybe you'll get to relive yours once you get, once you get up to heaven. <laughs> so I, I got a question rip mm -hmm. how do you uh you say everybody's got their their vice everybody's doing that shit how do you keep from uh from crossing the line where you can't come back from shit how do you stay focused enough to because you are always you've always been one that just you just fucking love the business and never, nothing ever got in front of it and well, I, I had my time where i love the business and then shit got in front of it well the I was always years ago. We worked so much. We were busy all the time. I mean, we, we was probably in the car on an average of six hours a night. Then be into the show there an hour. Plus you got to get your gym time in. I was taking my food with me everywhere I went. And it was just, there's so many, so many hours in the day. You guys probably flew a lot more and they'd, I would get, I would imagine you guys were driving a lot no, more and you were driving. We was driving. We was driving and it was hard. We might have, you know, five guys in a car, you know, sitting like this for how many hours. Uh. And I was just <laughs> focused on getting the main thing is, is eat right and get a workout. in. So you put those priority oh, on yeah. top of everything. Oh, yeah. Else. A, I, a, a, a blow. No, I don't know. The blow job ain't happening. I'm training and I'm eating fucking right. No matter what. Then if all that gets done, then we'll take a look and see what's out there. <laughs> and if not, if I got five minutes, let's go in the shower and rub one out. And then uh, I don't care about it anyway. Yeah. So yeah. what the fuck, right? The main thing is I, I ate right and I trained hard because that was my priorities. The other stuff really didn't give a fuck about it. But then we started entertaining ourselves. Do you think there was, there was more stress back then? Or more stress now, like traveling related. I used to bitch about flight travel all the time, walk, get, getting through airports and shit. But no, well, there's different ways of looking at it. You can take this plane, this plane, this, that, boom, or you can drive 10 hours one way, <laughs> work the show, drive 10 hours back. Yeah. All of a sudden, that plane is a hell of a lot easier, ain't it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, man. What, what, who spoiled? Who who used to say that? There, don't spurl them. Sp yeah, some of these guys maybe they were spoiled or whatever. Yeah, spurled. <laughs> yeah, but no, when no, I was a goddamn fucking trooper. <laughs> Work your balls off when you're fucking there. Get your shit done. You're uh, outwork them all. Then when you get hired, work twice as fucking hard. 
if you get yeah. fucking hurt and your legs fucked up, make have the world's greatest upper body of what you did have before. Big gold and a bill fold. So swole that I can't get the shit closed. So I money fold and rubber band wrap. And when it pops.